Let's go, let's go, I'll hit the road with you. Let's go, let's go, where our hearts, they lead us to. Cause home is anywhere when I'm with you. Ooh. Wow, Albany is the place to be. I love the historic architecture. I love the people that I work with. I'm here because of all of these folks and so many more that we get to work with every day. I personally believe Albany is the greatest town in the state of Oregon and probably the West Coast. I want everyone to know what a wonderful community we have. I want them to recognize our small businesses. I just really like to lift them up. I have worked with Rebecca since the first day she showed up at the Albany Visitors Association. And she just hit the ground running almost 28 years ago and never stopped. So actually, I started as a volunteer and worked my way through all the jobs. Started as the executive director uh, about five years ago. I had the pleasure of working with Rebecca at Albany Visitors Association, the Albany Downtown Association, and now here at the Carousel, the building we're all in today. And truly, without Rebecca's leadership, this Carousel building would not be here, and the thousands and thousands of people that visit here wouldn't know about it without Rebecca and all the work that she does through Albany Visitors to help tell our story. It's her dedication to the community and her ability to communicate with so many different kinds of people. The smile, the attitude, the, the ever-present positivity that comes off of her, radiates off of her, is, is amazing. She's one of those people who, uh, like a benevolent shark, she's constantly <laughs> moving, but she's taking everybody along with her, so she has a vision. Our vision is to include everyone. We are adamant about making sure that people are heard. We want to listen to what they have to say, what they have to contribute. And the more people that we have involved in all of our activities, in our events, the more welcoming we are to visitors too. And having somebody at the Visitors Association that is driving that vision, driving the atmosphere, and bringing people to the city and bringing people out in the city to participate, it makes this place much better for all of us to live. Rebecca has a talent for identifying what needs to happen in order for people to feel at home. And one of them is inclusivity and accessibility. Accessibility is really important. It's important for people to be able to get around and to navigate and to feel welcome everywhere they go. I was so excited to be able to get an automatic door opener at our office. I mean, it's just a start though. If we can do this with our, our door, opening doorways for people, we can create a template for other businesses to see how they can also do this. If you haven't picked up on it yet, this isn't a job for Rebecca. This is a lifestyle for yes. her. It really makes a difference for our communities and the economic impact of tourism, but it also adds to the value of life here in Albany for our residents. What we do creates opportunities for people to enjoy where they live. One of the things about working with bringing local people in means that you bring that volunteer base in. You're yeah. bringing that enthusiasm. Yeah. Yeah. Getting volunteers in the way that Rebecca and the Visitors Association is able to do is pretty miraculous, I think. Well, and she does it by showing up. She shows up. Yeah, she's present. Everywhere. Yeah. And present. And it makes people want to do it, not just that, oh, I, I guess my God, Rebecca's doing it. I guess I have to do it, too. <laughs> it is essential for this person here sitting in front of me to be our executive director of our visitor association. Knowing that we have one of the most capable professionals in the country at the helm of our organization, it inspires confidence. What Rebecca does best is just bring joy. Wherever she is, she's got the passion and the energy, and she's always telling our story, relentless through tourism, to tell the reason why people need to get off the freeway and discover this historic downtown. And without her in her 27 years, right. we wouldn't be what we are today. So come visit Albany and say hello to her at the Albany Visitor Center.